This dying pot, uh, you know, they make they make it by using indigo plants and uh, two types of you know ashes, so that uh, they it remains uh, in that pot till at least one week. It you know per, uh, per itself, so after that it will be usable. So they put such kind of uh, you know clothes inside it. So it became, uh, it became, you know, dying one, and also uh, this pot, uh, all this, you know, ingredients, natural ingredients that you know put together in such pots, uh, is also uh, it, it, it is du it is duration, uh, it 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 takes at, at least one year or more than that. <laughs> Everybody who wants to, you know, uh, change the color of his, uh, you know, cloth, for example, from white to uh, this blue color. So it's a traditional way of dyeing the clothes. So before it's a common uh, cloth for everybody, but now it becomes unique, you know, because uh, it is rare and also. Uh, we apply modern, uh, you know, t modern, uh, you know, way of dyeing our clothes. Even uh, most of the clothes are already dyeing uh, by the, you know, manufacturers. So that now a lot of, uh, you know, people that are unique also. For example, they used to, uh, you know, pr uh, prepare it as a, uh, you know, something that has relation to history. As they even, uh, you know, stated that. Each decoration you can see here it symbolizes you know something. For example, <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
uh, symbolizes power and uh, knowledge that is education and someone symbolizes uh, you know uh, our traditions like uh, the way that AMS do to uh, or used to you know uh, wear their clothes and also used to decorate their uh, palaces. Where some people put? Your skin. Ah ah. This clothes is made with by hand. The textile. It is a sewed one. They sew it. After that. They bring it to the dying ports. 